Well, the women out now for the final of the 4x400 four metres. And they we're expecting the fifth successive win by the crack East German squad. But that's the Polish team who uh, line up in lane five. It's the East German squad outside them. The full lineup is Spain, Italy, then West Germany, Poland, East Germany, Bulgaria, and the Soviet Union. No British squad out here. That's uh, the lead-off girl, Kirstein Emmelmann for East Germany, who will hand to Sabine Bush, to Petra Muller, to Marita Koch. And since they've won this uh, the last four occasions, incidentally, the time before that in Athens, Great Britain were the winners. The first time it was held in 69, and we haven't had a squad uh, for some considerable time now. Bulgaria, Marinova, Pavlova, Stoyanova, and Stamenova in their squad. And, uh, and I suppose uh, the favourites for the silver medal, the Soviet Union, Ikinautes, Nasarova, Stepanova, and Vladyakina. But I think uh, most of the 70,000 here will believe that uh, this is another demonstration because they've got such sprinting power in depth. Eva Kasperchik is doing well to hold Kirstin Emmelmann at the moment, but Kirsty Emmelmann is up on uh, Marinova of Bulgaria and has closed on the Soviet Union, so they're already in the lead. And when uh, they've finished the straight and handed over, and the next bend is run, and then you'll get a true assessment of where the lead is. Well, you can take it from me that Sabine Bush, the silver medalist in the 400 meters hurdles, will have a very substantial lead. The Soviet girls run well, but the East German batten's there. So too is the Soviet, so is the West German, so is the Polish now, and uh, the Spaniards uh, and the Italians trailing badly. Off goes Sabin Bush, who uh, must be disappointed at not winning the gold medal in the event which he's dominated for so long, the 400 metres hurdles. And there the battle for the silver medal includes the West Germans, and they've done well. That's Uta Tim, who took the baton from Gisela Kinsel. They've got Gaugel and Busman to come, so they could hold the Soviets, and it could be a great day. And what a roar they'll be from this 70,000. They've been taking the roof off all afternoon, as it were. And... Uh, and Uta, Uta, Uta Tim is being roared on and she's had a marvellous leg. However, the East Germans get away. Petra Muller and Galgirl has the baton. And what a lead she's got over the Soviet Union and the Poles. And uh, the Soviet girl, Stepanova, that's the 36-year-old who won the gold medal in the 400 metres hurdles. And they're putting her out in the squad, but looking very relaxed is Petra Muller for the German Democratic Republic. And look at the gap that they've opened up on West Germany. But Heidi Gaugel, eighth in the 100 metres. This is a long test for her. And this is where the silver medal will be won off as the Soviet Oshanova at D6, full of him and running, has uh, really run a magnificent leg. But the baton safely in the hand of Marita Koch. West Germany have the baton now, Gabby Bushman. And after her is Olga Vladiakina, the silver medalist in the individual 400. And there's going to be drama on the second leg. Forget the gold medal, that's already East Germany's. The gap is about 60 metres, but watch the Soviet girl and Gabby Busman. That's what the drama is about now for this 70,000 crowd. Superb running for Marita Koch to bring her magnificent career to a possible close. But the battle is on for the silver. Vladi Akina and Gabby Bushman. Vladi Bushman holding on. Bush and Vladi Akina goes past by a yard. A yard and a half. Only a yard. And it's the bronze for West Germany. The silver to the Soviet Union. Then Poland. Then Spain. But uh, it was a fine, fine race for the silver medal. It was a magnificent demonstration, yet again, of gold medal relay running by this quartet. Kirsten Emmelman, Sabine Bush, Petra Muller, Marita Koch. The clock stops at 3.16.88, and it's the second fastest that this race has ever been run. The East German women's team running the second fastest. Only the East German team has run faster than that. So five successive golds in this particular event go to the East Germans. Tremendous run.
and of course a new championship record. Very sporting crowd, I must say. They cheered uh, when the German high jumpers were out. They cheered the Russians on. When the Russians won, they just cheered that. They were hoping and hoping. And look at this, a standing ovation for this magnificent women's quartet from East Germany.